men are relaxing and eating well. They're eating well, living well, living simple lives of luxury. Women really screwed up. They don't even realize what they've lost. Men are walking away and focusing on themselves, their own happiness, and their own well-being. If a man wants a relationship, he's going overseas, finding a Filipina, a Latina, or someone else outside of Western society that still appreciates men and actually desires them. You have to realize that in Western society, because of social media, women have lost the ability to peer bond. The more men that women are physically intimate with, the more difficult it is to peer bond with a single man because women now raise their expectations with every man that they are physically intimate with. They actually take notes. A lot of women will take literal notes in their phones and record the specific things they liked or disliked about specific men that are just virtually every man that they've been physically intimate with. They do this so that they can then return to these men later on for more physical intimacy. Who in the world does something like that? These are extremely masculine women, all right? Back in the day, men used to have a thing called a little black book. And this was understandable because these are, you know, a man had to work hard to fill that book up with numbers. Women, on the other hand, all they have to do is go on social media and then they keep track of these men and they go back to these men even when they're in relationships with other men. But, you know, you already know how it is. She was never yours. It was just your turn. I've said this before that the manosphere is going to begin moving away from a lot of this content. Not so much it will go away entirely where you're talking about women, but more so just things like cooking and you know, and enjoying food and, you know, enjoying life in general, things that men love. You know, think about this. What are the simple things that a woman has to do to keep a man? All she has to do is feed him and F him. And, and, and most women struggle with that. There's a video from Rec Tech. We're going to be jumping into that today. And we're going to watch as, as, as he's preparing these amazing ribs. Because more, this is some of the things that men are doing, cooking delicious foods inside their homes grilling, barbecuing. These are things that would cost hundreds of dollars at a restaurant. And these are things that men are doing, creating their own rubs, experimenting. It is absolutely beautiful. Let's just go ahead and jump right in. And I'll link you to his channel. Hey everybody, welcome to The Real Show Barbecue. Today we're gonna to be cooking rotisserie ribs on the TurbiQ rotisserie cooker. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and season our ribs up. This is a nice rack of ribs that we have here. We're gonna put a little bit of olive oil on both sides. Spray it down real good. All right, we got our olive oil on. We put it on both sides. I've already removed the membrane off the back. We're gonna do two layers, and we're gonna be using Suckle Busters on both. And this is the SPG rub by Suckle Busters. Our next layer is gonna be the hog waller. This is some great stuff. I did some ribs a while back on the Jumbo Joe. I'll put a link up above to that video as well. Again, all sides. Now that we have our ribs all seasoned up, we're gonna let these sit out and let all this sweat really well and absorb some of the seasoning. And we'll get the turbic ready. So we'll see you out there. All right, we got the ribs turning. It's self-propelled from the heat. The charcoals are lit from the bottom and the heat rises up and turns that rotisserie. Again, it's self-propelled. And we're looking at about an hour all right, we've taken the ribs off. As you can see, there's a bow in there. And that's from when it was on the rotisserie spinning. And we put some barbecue sauce on it and it's the Barbecue Beast Carolina. We put that on there and let it sit for about 15 or 20 minutes. So let's cut into it. I'm gonna have to probably turn it up so I can see what the bone is at. We didn't use any smoke because it was only in there for an hour, so cut off a couple pieces here, and then we'll bring you in close to let you take a look at them. Hopefully you can see it like right here. There's a lot of juice going on in there. Lots and lots of juice. So let's give it a try right quick. Hopefully you can see that. It's some great color. We're going to give it a bite right quick. 
pulls away from the bone, doesn't fall off the bone. It's cooked perfect. It's a little thin on this side. Mm -mm -mm. Let's give it a bite on here on this side. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. The flavors of that barbecue beast, along with suckle busters. That was beautiful, wasn't it? That was absolutely beautiful. And I've said that we're going to be seeing more and more content like this, more and more videos like this of men just throwing down in the kitchen. Look at look how hungry you all are right now. Ah, look at you. Look how hungry you are. You just watched that video, him seasoning up that meat. Now y'all want some ribs. You're like angry. Damn you, angry. Damn you, angry. I'm going to, have to, I'm going to, have to go and get me, get me some ribs right now. But this is where we're heading. This is where the manosphere is really heading. Bunch of men just, you know, Chewing bubblegum and praising Jesus. I hear idiots. And I see comments from idiots sometimes like, we need to band together and fight this thing. Y'all, sometimes the path of least resistance is the best path. We don't have a dog in this fight. This is not our country. We are just allowed to live here, and we are not even wanted here. Why would anyone fight for something that hates them? Why would anyone fight for people who don't like them? who absolutely resent them for existing. It's not going to happen. You know, if that's the attitude you have, go hang out with the MGTOWs. And don't get me wrong, we have MGTOWs who are also a part of MWA. But if you if that's all you're about, you can go argue. Look at what happened to the MGTOWs. They're banned on YouTube. They're banned. They can't even make videos anymore. All right? They like they've like these people are crazy. We're going to fight until the end. Fight for what, bro? Fight for what? How about fighting for yourself? How about focusing on yourself and just living a peaceful life? Like, what kind of life are you really happy? Are, are you really trying to live? Do you want to be happy and chill and just relax and enjoy the life that you have? Or do you want to go and be miserable and pick fights with everyone? Like, 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 seriously, like, that's the difference between like some of these things. These guys are not actually walking away. They're not going their own way. All right. Because there's a... <laughs> There's actually there's a destination. MWA has no destination. Men are going to going wherever they feel, where they're appreciated, where they're celebrated. They're going wherever they choose to go. They're walking away from the things that don't work for them, including families, families, children, home countries. If it doesn't work for you, walk away from it. Jobs. You know, look how beautiful that was. Look how nice that food. You were smelling that food across the screen. All right. I'm laying, I'm, I'm here right now. Working on this video for you, thinking to myself, boy, I'm going to have to order some ribs now. I was thinking about, I was thinking about getting pizza. I was like, oh, okay, I can get some pizza. Then after watching this video, I'm like, ah, oh, damn it, I'm going to have to go and get some ribs. And it's like, angry, you know you want some, you know you want some ribs now. You're watching a video right now. You y'all know you want some ribs. You know you so you know you want some ribs after seeing that video. See those beautiful ribs, beautiful ribs. Look at that. Rub those ribs down. He rubbed those ribs down. With that seasoning, look how beautiful that is. That's a beautiful marinade right there. You can smell that. Oh my gosh! Imagine if you had some dogs right now; they'd be going crazy, just just barking. Like, give me a piece of that. Come on, come on. Don't you love me? Give me one of those. I might actually get some ribs after this. I might actually get some ribs. I feel like I need to order some ribs, and I can actually get some ribs cheap, pretty pretty cheap, affordable right now. Thankfully. I might get some ribs. My gosh, because those ribs look so dead. Oh, my goodness. Beautiful boy. Oh, boy. Look at that meat. Look at that meat. Men killing it in the kitchen, cooking it in it, just throwing down the kitchen. Woo! Woo! That's some beautiful, some beautiful ribs right here. By the way, guys, if you're enjoying the content on this channel, you want even more of this content, consider checking out the Men Walking Away channel where I release daily videos. There's a link to the description of the video. Go check it out. Subscribe to the channel. Enjoy the content. What do you guys think regarding all of this? Men are relaxing and eating well as everything crashes and burns around us. Let us let me know your thoughts. We'll talk about it in the comments. Like the video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you like the video, share the video. And just remember that all roads lead to MWA. Men walking away. And cheers.